the Apple device here and today I'll be telling you how to get IC for the iPhone, iPad and iPod Touch. As of now it's compatible with 4.3x so whichever as long as it's 4.3 and higher and um, they're gonna be doing it for all iOS devices pretty much so if you don't know what IC is it's pretty much a alternative for Cydia and kind of like Rock but um, different again so um, you guys know that rock closed down and stuff, so this is going to be something else. A whole new rock is icy. It was out before, but then they had problems with it, and they just stopped and discontinued it. And then now, they're starting to continue it. So if you want to get this, right now it's in beta. It will be coming out for a full release next week. So next week, you can go ahead and just download it regularly through Cydia without a, without a extra repo. But I'll show you guys how to get this right now. So... Um, go ahead and open up Cydia and hit the manage tab and c hit sources edit add and what what you want to type in right here is this I'll switch over to my iPad right here repo dot is Pazio.net. You gotta type that in right there. I'll have it in the link's description. After you've typed that in, go ahead, find it, and click on it. And then find IC. So I'll go to the I section. And it'll be right there. Install it. And once you've installed that, that's pretty much it. So open up IC. And then you'll be greeted to this page, and like I said, this is beta. Some stuff works, some stuff doesn't work. But I've kind of been messing around with the home page. I think it's kind of cool. So um, it just talks about that you can go ahead and slide to unlock right there. And now you go ahead and customize your home page for IC. So let's say I want this one right here. So now, my home page for IC is going to be like this. If I hit Twitter, for instance, it's going to bring up the developer's Twitter page. I'll go back. If I hit YouTube, it's going to bring up the developer's YouTube page. I think he doesn't have a YouTube, so I don't think it's going to be up. And then Cydia is just going to bring a um, something like this, I guess, of Cydia. And it's just pretty much how Cydia has its home page. This will be the home page. What I've noticed though is when you go ahead and exit the um, exit Cydia from multitasking bar, well, if you just exit Cydia and open it up again, it's in multitasking, so this page will be fine, same. But if you go ahead and exit it out from multitasking, so pretty much like that, it's not gonna be same. You're gonna have to redo the whole process. I guess it's in beta, and they'll be fixing this up. So now you gotta go ahead and just reslide to unlock. It can be a pain sometimes. It's not doing it. It's a little. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, it it's a little hard to do at times, but just don't exit it, it out of the multitasking bar, and you'll be good to go. So yeah. Um. So yeah, that that's pretty much it. You can go ahead and then choose yours. I'll just click click blue ponage, just for another theme to show you guys. So yeah, here's how it looks. You can kind of scroll around. It's kind of cool. And then there, there's categories. Like I said, it's in beta, so not everything works perfectly. But you can just check it out and see what to expect with it. And then under about, it, sh it shows um, the information right here. Regardless who's... I think it has a couple Twitter accounts on there and stuff. It says the, um, the beta that, that you're running on, I guess. And then, because I hit install and it doesn't show nothing there. So I guess this is the beta that I'm running on. So yeah, that, that's pretty much it. If you like IC, well, I do recommend having another uh, application that does things like Cydia could do. Because if, it, like, if out of nowhere Cydia stops working, you need to have a backup. Or you'll have to end up restoring. So I recommend downloading IC even if you're not going to be using it. So you, you'll have a backup either, either if Cydia breaks or something happens to Cydia. So yeah, download this even if you're not going to use it. That's what I re recommend. You can always... um. 
it doesn't take lots of the room and there are videos out there I have that will let you I'll just probably add it down below in the links description if you want to go ahead and add this um, application download IC and you, you're not going to be using it I'll have a video down below that will show you how to hide applications on your iPhone iPad iPod touch so you can hide it and then if something happens to Cydia then you can just use this application I see um, from there okay so yeah I don't know if I mentioned you can get I see on the iPad so I do not know how it looks yet on the iPad but you never know I'll um, try it out so okay rate comment subscribe and I'll catch you guys in my next video